Welcome to a meditative compline for September 1st, 2022, the 13th Thursday after Pentecost. Compline is the office that completes the day. It has been called the bedtime prayer of the church. It opens and ends with a time of silence. The mood of the entire office is one of peace and tranquility. Both speaking and singing are done quietly. You should remain in a comfortable position throughout this meditation. Be still, aware of God's presence within and around you. No words can match God's power and strength in the quiet. It can take a lot of effort to feel the peace and solitude. Maybe you have never felt it. That's okay. Jesus can be our model when we need to give ourselves permission to stop and surrender to a moment of stillness. O oh God, come to our assistance. O oh Lord, hasten to help us. The Holy One grant us a restful night and peace at the last. Amen. Our night hymn, The Beauteous Day Now Closes. The beauteous day now closes, each flower and tree repose. This shade creeps o'er wild and wood. Let us, as night is falling, on God our Maker calling, give thanks to God the Giver good. Now all the heavenly splendor breaks forth in starlight. Tender from myriad worlds unknown, and we this marvel seeing forget our selfish being for joy of beauty, not our own. Oh, while our mortal blindness may miss God's loving kindness and grope in faithless strife, but when life's day is over, shall death's fair night discover the fields of everlasting life. Our confession and assurance. O most holy and beloved, our companion, our guide upon the way, our bright evening star, we repent the wrongs we have done. We have wounded your love, O God, heal us. We stumble in the darkness, light of the world, transfigure us. We forget that we are your home. Spirit of God, dwell in us. The eternal Spirit, living God, in whom we live and move and have our being, all that we are, have been, and shall be, is known to you, to the very secrets of our hearts and all that rises to trouble us. Living flame, burn into us. Cleansing wind, blow through us. Fountain of water, well up within us. 
that we may love and praise in deed and in truth. We are a forgiven people. Thanks be to God. Our help is in the name of the Lord, who made heaven and earth. Psalm 134 Behold now, bless God, all you servants of God, you that stand by night in the house of God. Lift up your hands in the holy place and bless God. God who made heaven and earth bless you from Zion. Glory to the holy and blessed Trinity, one God, now and forever. Amen. A reading comes from 1 Peter chapter 5, verses 8 and 9. Be sober, be vigilant, because your adversary, the devil, is prowling around like a roaring lion seeking for someone to devour. Resist him, strong in the faith. Holy wisdom, holy word. Thanks be to God. Keep watch, dear Lord, with those who wake or watch or weep this night and give your angels charge over those who sleep. Tend the sick, give rest to the weary, sustain the dying, calm the suffering, and pity the distressed. All for your love's sake, O Christ our Redeemer. Amen. Eternal Spirit, Life Giver, Pain bearer, love maker, source of all that is and that shall be, Father and Mother of us all, loving God in whom is heaven, the hallowing of your name echo through the universe, the way of your justice be followed by the peoples of the world, your heavenly will be done by all created beings. Your commonwealth of peace and freedom sustain our hope and come on earth. With the bread we need for today, feed us. In the hurts we absorb from one another, forgive us. In times of temptation and test, strengthen us. From trials too great to endure, spare us. From the grip of all that is evil, free us. For you reign in the glory of the power that is love, now and forever. Amen. Our night hymn, God who made the earth and heaven. God who made the earth and heaven, darkness and light. Who the day for toil has given, for rest the night. May thy angel guards defend us, slumber sweet thy mercy send us. Holy dreams and hopes attend us this live long night. When the constant sun returning on seals our eyes may we born anew like morning to labor rise gird us for the test that calls us let not ease and self enthrall us strong through thee whatever befall us O oh, god most wise In peace we will lie down and sleep. In the Lord alone we safely rest. Guide us waking 
my Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. May the divine help remain with us always and with those who are absent from us. Into your hands, O oh Lord, I commend my spirit, for you have redeemed me, O oh Lord, O oh God of truth. Canticle of Simeon Lord, you have now set your servant free to go in peace as you have promised. For these eyes of mine have seen the Savior, whom you have prepared for all the world to see, a light to enlighten the nations, and the glory of your people Israel. Glory to you, O Trinity, most holy and blessed, one God, now and forever. Amen. My brothers and sisters, may the Holy and Blessed Trinity guard and bless us. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. Sleep in peace tonight. Amen. <laughs>